I got such a lot of positive feedback yesterday about my little piece on the Highland Boundary Fault. So I wanted to talk to you again tonight um, about something else that's um, tectonic in nature and is also keeping it pretty local. So I've come down to the hill um, that we all know as Dumgoyne and it's part of the Campsie Fells. Now together the Dumgoyne is part of the Campsie Fells and it's known as the Sleeping Giant. Now, Dumgoyne itself, actually, this isn't a good angle for it. I'm going to actually upload a, a picture that would show it a lot better. Dumgoyne would actually be the head of the sleeping giant. And Dumgoyne itself is what we know as the uh, volcanic plug. Now, most people would associate Scotland with being volcanic, but it actually is um, or it has got lots of evidence of volcanic activity. And we were in the past and um, we did have lots of uh, tectonic activity. We had lots of active volcanoes and earthquakes as well. But as I say, we wouldn't really get too many of them these days. Although along those fault lines that I was telling you about last night, we might get some. And you do hear about it every so often in Scotland and in um, England in particular, where you find um, some very small um, earthquakes happening. And that's just because of the fault lines and cracks in the earth's crust that we have. So a volcanic plug which is Dumgoyne, um, is formed when this was an active volcano and magma got stuck in the vent of the volcano and it literally plugged it, um, meaning that no more magma could come out. Now, what might happen if this happened today in a more tectonically active place is that eventually that plug would literally be blown out. Um, but by a further eruption. But obviously an, another eruption didn't happen. So this particular event was just left um, with a plug inside or which was hardened rock eventually. Now over time, this rock would um, become eroded and weathered by the different elements and it's taken the shape to what it is today. So Dumboyne is a well-known landmark uh, within the, this area. Most of you will have climbed it um, at some point before and if you haven't then you should um, and we know it in geography as a volcanic plug.